I only buy the finest TV system. See UPF. BOPF is indicated on the pack. Sista, the art of tea. Although the town of Ampara was established parallel to the Galloway settlement scheme as a commercial hub founded on agriculture in later years, it had been subject to neglect. In order to mitigate the shortcomings that arose as a result of this neglect in 1980, the Ampara town was selected for the Gum Udava program. Subsequently, for close to three decades, the Ampara town also fell under the dark shadow of the war. Following the return of civil administration to the eastern province in 2008, not much weight was placed upon the development of infrastructure facilities in the Ampara town under the Nagani Hiranavodya program. However, with the decision to hold this year's Data Kerala National Development Exhibition in Ampara, the town witnessed hasty and sometimes chaotic development activity. The erecting of street lamps on the 2 km main and by roads in the town certainly shed a light for its citizens. The Ampara Urban Council is tasked with the maintenance of the 60 street lamps that were put up at a cost of 75,000 rupees each. 24 of these LED street lamps are now inactive. The renovation of the roads in the town parallel to the Datakil exhibition has resulted in major complexity. As a result, it is possible to witness residents in the urban limits using torches when traveling past certain locations in the town. Even the 36 street lamps that are in working condition are only switched on by the urban council for a period of about two hours. The Ampara town which sees sporadic incursions by wild elephants is also a haven for cattle which roam about freely. Shouldn't inquiries be held to ascertain the reasons behind the shortening of the lifespan of the light that was provided parallel to a festival held to symbolize the benefits of development brought about by peace? Chairman of the Ampara District Development Coordination Committee, this is over to you.